city officials and district leaders rolled up their sleeve and got down and dirty shoveling mulch to signify change and growth in the form of the reinstatement A level of landscape maintenance for the Victoria Neighborhoods Parks District. Today we're really kind of marking a new chapter in the Landscape Maintenance District out here for the Victoria neighborhood as we restore the services of their landscape maintenance to an A level, which is the highest service that the city provides. So today we wanted to really celebrate that change, going from a, a B level of service back to an A and recognize the, the faith that the community had in us to restore that level of service and just kind of mark that event today with the spreading of the mulch and really cleaning up some of the landscape areas that we have in these sites. As you can see behind me with the, with the bare ground, um, we're able to cover that up with the mulch, we're saving some water, reducing weed growth, and really improving the overall look of the district as well while we do it. The city held the kickoff event to ensure that citizens recognized that their money was quickly going back into the community to improve the overall aesthetics and features of the neighborhood. The assessment rates on the properties have remained consistent since about 1993 and obviously since that time our cost for providing services has gone up and the rates did not progress with, the, with those costs. So several months ago, the community, through a ballot process, um, decided to increase the assessment rates. They approved that increase to restore their services back to an A level of service. And as a result of that, that's given us the necessary funding to bring the property or bring the landscaping back to an A level of service. The last several years, this neighborhood has not looked quite like it should because the assessment rates had been held steady for 20 years and costs have obviously grown since that time. So now with the new assessment rates in place, we're able to really bring this back to doing maintenance the Rancho Way. For us, that means A level service, more frequent service, more detailed landscape maintenance and a lot of capital improvement projects in the six parks in this neighborhood. The neighborhood includes over 6,000 residents, about six parks, and over 8 million square feet of landscaped areas which will benefit from the new landscaping and maintenance program. They can expect to see our maintenance crews out more frequently doing that real detailed maintenance that makes the, the landscaping look really nice. The cleaning out the undergrowth of the shrubs, more frequent weeding, more frequent trash removal, the ball fields being maintained weekly little things like basketball nets being replaced as they deteriorate. All those kinds of things that really make the neighborhood shine we'll, we'll, we'll be able to do now as a result of those changes. Not only is the new maintenance program making the district more attractive, but it's also attracting residents to get outside and get healthy. I think it's much more enjoyable if you're going to go out for a walk or a bike ride and you walk through an area that looks nice, it's well maintained. I also think it helps to instill a stronger sense of community pride. Um, certainly the, the residents had a lot of pride in their neighborhood and uh, we were all very concerned with the lower level of maintenance um, and, and then the residents obviously wanted to make sure that they were able to maintain that higher level of maintenance and really in that there is that good sense of community and that pride and, and the residents and neighbors have all been very thankful and very supportive of the process and, and are very engaged with what we do, provide us with great feedback and been very helpful as well. Since July 1st, projects that have already been completed include the block wall and light pole repair at the, at the entrance to Victoria Arbors Park. Grass is being fertilized and cared for on a more frequent basis. Ball fields have gone back to being maintained once a week and trash removal is being done weekly. And there is a roster of more improvements on the way. Bringing you the best of Rancho Cucamonga, I'm Conchetta DeLuca with Healthy RC Living.